A now former Lee County deputy get arrested and escorted to jail. The 18 year old is accused of leaking confidential information about an investigation. Thank you for watching NBC2. I'm Peter Bush. And I'm Kelly Burns. The Lee County Sheriff says corrections deputy Garai Uzin posted sensitive internal information on Snapchat. NBC2 Sarah Metz is outside the courthouse in Collier County where Uzin lives. Sarah, why wasn't he in court today? Yeah, Kelly, he wasn't in court today because he was listed as a medical refusal. Now, we didn't know what that meant when we were inside the courthouse. However, when I walked outside, his family told me it's because he had some sort of cold. But we didn't see him inside the courtroom today. However, Sheriff Carmine Marcino did show Usman's face during his press conference. He was a certified law enforcement correctional deputy. Was, as in past tense. But now Gure Uzin is on the other side of a jail. U-Z-E-N. Sheriff Carmine Marcino says for nine months, the 18-year-old worked for the sheriff's office. About two weeks ago, we discovered a snapshot of a Lee County Sheriff's Office computer screen containing sensitive information that had been leaked. Investigators say they linked the leak to Uzin. Uzin, the turncoat, was immediately placed on administrative leave and removed from work with no access to any information. They say he gave out intel through Snapchat about recent street racing investigations, allegedly to people directly involved in those cases, as a warning to them. Because he was a certified corrections deputy, he had easy access to all of this inside information. Um, then the bond that we're asking for is 50000 your honor, it's a third degree felony. But Sheriff Carmine Marcino says what he did was a choice. I don't have one good thing to say about what he did. Matter of fact, I'm sickened by it. Now, the judge did set his bond to $10,000 and made no moves to make sure that Uzin got back to Lee County like the state originally asked for. We're, lo we're local today from Collier County. Sarah Metz, NBC2.